Hello and what is up Lego Harry Potter 2020 fans? Um, a few days ago the Lego Harry Potter 2020 Diagon Alley set got revealed. It's so cool. Um, I really like it. Um, this is the front of the box here. So now I'm just going to show you the back and then I'll do um, some stuff where I show you the characters and as well as the shops themselves. So yeah. So here's the back of the box. You can see there's lots of cool features. Um, really, really cool. So yeah, let's check out the minifigures now. Here is the first minifigures. It's Hagrid from 2018, as well as this Molly Weasley, the same head from Hilga Hufflepuff um, and the burrow from Molly Weasley and the same hairpiece. And it's just a different outfit. So let's check out the minifigures. So we did not get Ray Skeeter, but we did get a um, Daily Prophet reporter. Um, and then that other guy there, um, who I didn't know who he was, he was the guy who works at um, the ice cream shop. So let's check out the minifigures. So the next minifigures are um, Draco and Draco Malfoy. Um, <laughs> not Draco and Draco Malfoy. Um, Draco and Lucius Malfoy there. Um... Um, next, I'm going to show you a picture of Lucius and, um, the, what's his name, Gilderoy Lockhart. Then I'll show you the other characters. So, let's check out that right now. So, there's Gilderoy. He looks really good. Um, surprised they used that hairpiece. Um, but I guess it's fine. Looks still pretty cool. And Lucius is using for the wand staff. It's just a regular black, um, like, stick piece kind of um that's a bit disappointing and the face is also a bit disappointing on lucius but i guess it's fine let's check out the next minifigures it is mr and mr weasley the weasley twins um fred and george um they look really nice in the weasley wizard weasel suits um just really nice minifigures to get them twice in 2020 so let's check out the next minifigures here are the next minifigures. Um, you can see there's Ron, Hermione, and then Ginny is the one I'm really focusing on here. Um, to get two, three Ginnies is great as well. Um, so, yeah. Ron and Hermione look pretty good, too. So, then there's also Harry, um, which I'll show you later. I just couldn't find a picture of him in the character thing. So, yeah, let's check out the shops now. So the next shop is the front of Flourish and Blots here. Um, looks really nice. I love all that detailing. So let's check out the inside of Flourish and Blots now. Here is the inside. You can see there's Gilderoy and there's the Harry minifigure. I like how they made those books up there. Um, just pretty cool. And then I like the balcony up above. Um, really cool. Let's check out the next shop. One of my favorites. So here it is, it's quality Quidditch surprise. At the bottom, there is a Hufflepuff Quidditch robe. I really wanted, I really want to make a um, Cedric Diggory Quidditch player. So if I could get like, um, just like on eBay or something, a few spare, spares of those, that would be really cool. Um, you see the Firebolt is in the window there. Um, Ginny, um, Ron and Molly are in the shop right now, and also there is a Ravenclaw one, which is also going to be pretty um, popular, I think. So, let's check out the next shop. It is Weasley Wizard Weezes. Oh my, it looks so good. Um, Just all that detailing and stuff is just really cool. All the jokes, um, they did, Lego did a great job. I really like the stairs. Um, let's take a better look at the bottom floor now. So here's a quick look at the bottom floor. It looks really nice. You can see those love potions and stuff. So let's check out, um, not the final shop. I just couldn't find a picture of all of Anders, but let's check out the ice cream shop now. I actually did find an image of all of Anders. I'm going to show you it after this. And also the other shop, um, the Ink and Quail shop. So the ice cream shop is pretty small. You can see Flourish and Blotts is over there as well. Um, so it's actually connected really tight together. Um, but it's small, and it's okay. I kind of like the lamp up there. So let's check out the picture of Ollivanders. So I didn't find um, the Ink and Quail shop, but I did find Oliver's and Ollivanders. And oh my gosh, they did exactly what I wanted. They made um, a box that could actually fit a wand. 
Go, Lego Go. I love you so much, Lego. You are the best. Um, I couldn't really find an image of it, um, the upper area, but it's more wand stuff. And I believe you get two or three of those boxes that can actually fit the wand. Um, and we also are getting Ollivander in, like, a red jacket. And he's got a different facial special expression. So, um, I didn't find Sibley's, but I think that's what it's called. Um, but I did find Ollivander's, and it's just so good. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.